previously on Commander Versus. It was the revenge of the revenge of the revenge of the Revengers episode. John was feeling very impulsive on the day and decided to maximize the chaos. Unfortunately, Justin felt the wrath of this impulsive decision as it enabled Jeremy to hit him with the old three-piece and take him out in a single combat. After that, Jeremy fell to the mind of a single Kozilek swing which just left John and myself. I managed to whittle down all of his permanents with the nine later triggers just to show him who the boss was. So let's go to the points. Justin managed to get zero points on the week. I'm not surprised he was playing a Prophecy Bulk Rare and he deserved it. Jeremy got first blood and he killed someone with commander damage. He got punched in return by me and then uh, John managed to get three points by merely surviving the whole time and uh, I reigned supreme with five points. This week we're playing Zendikar Rising Legends and I know we're all eager to get our hands on some new cards, but first let's look at some deck decks. This week, I'm going to be playing Tazri Beacon of Unity. This card cares about the party mechanic, which cares about rogues, warriors, wizards, and clerics. But with this deck, I'm also going with a legendary theme. That means that most of the creatures in it are legendary, and it has a few of the legendary spells in it as well. This week, I'm playing Ashaya, Soul of the Wild. And as I usually do, whenever a new set comes out, I look to our good friend Benny Smith for a deck, and he did not fail me this week. I am probably playing easily the most powerful deck this week, and I wanted to channel a little bit of my inner Justin Parnell, and I'm playing a few infinite combos in here. Uh, normally we don't do that, but don't tell anybody else. We're just going to see how it unfolds in the game, and hopefully we'll come out on top. So for this week, I am playing Back to the Will again, a black-white deck, but I'm playing Aura Skyclave Herophant. I was able to work on this deck with my friend John Porter, and what we came up with was something that is directly up my alley, which is a bunch of old school clerics and new school clerics from Zendikar Rising. And we're gonna be bringing them in and out of the graveyard, in and out of the battlefield, maybe draining a little bit of life in the process, maybe drawing some cards in the process, but we're definitely gonna be accruing a significant amount of value. This week we're playing Cherix, the Rage and Isle, and we're looking to put the squeeze on everybody. Uh, we'll be able to try to manipulate our islands in play, you know, to control how powerful our squeezes are. And we'll be looking for a few ways, you know, to slip by and notice so that we can ensure we got a good grip on them for the squeeze. If you folks are ready, let's get in the game. I'm kicking us off here. I'm going to play a stomping ground tapped and pass the turn. I like that. I like that. I like that. Steven, oh, wow. I'm not a big fan of the fact that you stole Cherix from me, which was going to be the card I was going to play, and then you didn't wear a crab shark t shirt today. Um, it's not a shark to crab, it's a Leviathan crab. So you It's close to... enough. It's part crab. No, no. I'm you done. No, cl- I'm no, done. Crab. no crab shirts. Uh, failed passage. I'm just gonna crack this and get a planes and pass the turn. He's got no landfall. A forest and a Jiraga tree speaker. Oh, oh look at that. here we go! Look at that! Yeah. So it begins. Kicking us off early. All right, I'm gonna go swamp, Farseek. Nice. Ooh. And I am gonna go good. get myself a nice little triome here and pass the turn. Look at you with your triland. Oh, another island. Yeah. I bet there's a lot of those in your deck, Steven. There are quite a few. I'll be done after that. Ah. Lothora of all of the world's counterspells at your reach. <laughs> well, counterspell. I'm going to play a Swamp, and then I'm going to pass the turn. Yes. Yes. I am going to do what everyone does with Draga Tree Speaker and attack Jeremy for one. Yep. I would get, do that, one. get that first blood on the person in last That's one. right. Well, he can't get it on the person first, Jeremy. That's right. Normally, I would just level that up, and we wouldn't even think about it twice. But you know, uh, I'll level it up after that, though. So the person okay. in last was the only person that tapped out. So that's that's the main reason. So no offense. And, and we proved last week that I would willingly die in one shot to a commander just to prevent someone from getting first blood. That's so, true. That's true. You all done? He's a white. Yeah, yeah, I'm all done. It's all you. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm hearing. I'm hearing a lot of nonsense. Steven here. could have had some sort of you know flashy creature to block, and I wouldn't have liked that. So. Justin could easily have had removal. Well, you I'm going to do out. 
I'm going to do I what I do it. and tap out again for Sky Shard Claim. No way. I can't believe God. this. This is the first time Jeremy's ever cast Farseek and Stra Sky Shard Claim. So you, you're done after mm -hmm. that, right, Jeremy? I'm done after that, yeah. He might cast it a Gramp Rampart Growth. <laughs> Two drop ramp and a four drop ramp. I cannot believe it. Ah, that. go figure. No. Shocking. Is that a scavenger ground, Steven? It is. And we're going to play a Mirfolk Thermaturgist. 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 Yeah. Yep. yeah, that one. So that's the Planner Chaos one, right? Yeah. yeah it's uh, just a simple tap and switch to target features, power, and toughness. So if someone right. could gain control of that and then tap it and target Steven's commander, it would die. Yes. Uh, unless I pay three mana. Well, unless you don't have three. Are you done? Uh, I am finished. All right. Well, I'm going to get my own ramp on, but in a little bit more fun way. I'm going to play uh, Edgewalker. That's a very good card. All Star Edgewalker. Foil Edgewalker, mind you, too. Foil, it is a foil Edgewalker. Yeah, Edgewalker. you better be careful with that. Showing then, off, yeah. Then I'm going to play a Dark Supplicant. Oh, look how Legends. free that is. It is very free. I'm done. All right. And Dark Supplicant can get uh, Scion of Darkness, is that Scion of Darkness. Sacrifice three clerics. All right. That's pretty good. Not bad. I'm going to tap three. I'm going to play a Tireless Tracker. I like that. I'm going to play a Dust Bowl to make a clue. And I'll get that clue in just a second. And then I'm going to play a Sylvan Advocate, which gives, uh, as long as I control six or more lands, it and all land creatures I control will get plus two, plus two. That is a combo with your commander. It is a combo with my commander. But for now, it's just a Vigilant 2-3, uh, which is fine. And I will tell Jeremy to go. All right. That was going to be nonsense in my future. I mean, you were ramping. Jeremy's ramping. I'm tree speaking. It's true. You, you know what I love to do is ramp. You know what else I love to do is ramp even more. Here we go. This is Renewal. Uh, Prismatic Omen? Oh, boy. Which is not really ramp, but... No, but nothing normal. No, 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 nothing good comes from Prismatic Omen. Is, is, is there a one way? Just him? Or is it all of our lands? Uh, lands you control. Yeah, that's just that's, it. That's lame. Yeah. Uh, Arcane Signet, and then I will tap four, since I have an abundance of mana now, and Notice. play... Uh, Marisi, Breaker of the Coil. Marisi. Yeah. Hold on. Uh, Don't you have a... So you tapped four for Omen and Signet. I tapped two for... Yep, yep. You had four left over. Cool. Yeah, right. I had two, two for Omen, yep. two for Signet, and then I had four left over. Yep. And then you played Marisi, which is we can't cast spells during your combat. Can't, can't cast spells during combat whenever a creature I control during, deals combat no, no, damage to a player. During any combat. Yep. During combat. Yeah. And then... Uh, Whenever a creature I control deals combat damage to a player, goad each creature that player. Gets. Now, Jeremy, do you know how much I hate the word goad? I am aware. He loves it. And I'm going to pass the turn. I hate it so much. Well, there's Steven Tyler. We're putting our general in play. But it is there a it is. cat warrior, which is why it's in there. And you're up. So when you cast Cherix, do you think of Zoidberg with his little uh, his little claws, or do you think of the crab with the knife going around? I'm laughing because uh, I'm gonna play. Uh, I'm gonna I'm play gonna... Cavern of Souls and name Cleric. Oh, they can't be coward. And it's clerics? No way. Cleric, yeah. I mean, I wasn't trying to counter any of your spells because I'm your friend. That's good, Stephen. I'm glad you feel that way. Don't believe him. I I'm do sure. believe him, though. I, I thought I, he was talking to you. I shouldn't believe you. I'm going to play, for two mana, I'm going to play Aura, Skyclave, Aerophant. That card could be, be countered card. right now. It can't. It I use Cavern of Souls. For colorless? No, I added a, a, a black. Mm. I'm tapping Cavern of Souls. If I tap Cavern of Souls and cast a Cleric, it's not going to be countered. Um, it's fine. I don't, I'm not playing counter spells. I'm done. I'm hearing Suarez saying that he wants to counter it. 
No, no, no. You're hearing Suarez saying he wants someone else to counter it. Yes, correct. Yeah, he my wishes, mono green deck is not He wishes he it. could counter it. Yeah. yeah. He wants it to be countered. We're going to put the squeeze on you, John. You don't, you don't do that with counter spells. That's fair. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Draw a card. No one's going to believe what that one was. Forest. Bingo. That's what it was. It was forest. And by forest, I mean it could also be a creature because it's the same thing. That's true. It is the same. See, you figured it all out. I'm getting it. Already on high alert because you told me you were playing a Benny Smith deck. So That's true. You should I'm, be. I'm it's a mono green deck. Benny Smith deck, so you know what should be coming. So Nonsense. A whole lot of yeah, nonsense. Yeah, he's not a... He and apparently, mess around. infinite combos, so... Listen, all right, don't worry about the infinite combos. I, that was supposed to be a secret. And then all of a sudden, we changed how we did deck techs, and now everybody knows. I don't like it. I don't like it. Hey, right. we don't we don't like it either. The, uh, yeah, the infinite yeah. combos, we don't like it either. Weird. I also, uh, you know, read the article that Betty wrote. Uh, about this well, stuff. you know, you know, here we are. All right, <laughs> I'm gonna play an Orin Reef of the Vastwood. I'm gonna have a second clue for my tireless tracker. Um, let's see. I need to start drawing cards, or I feel like I'm going to run out of spells. Who can be attacked? Jeremy, how big is your creature? 5-4. Now that's large. That's large. Mm -hmm. Justin, how big is your commander? 3-3 three, three with lifelink. That's bigger than I would like to as well. All right, well, then I guess I'm not. And, J Stephen, you have a 0 -17. And a 1-2, yes. Yeah, got it. Big 0 -17. Biggest butt. All right, I'm going to just play my Guardian Project. Yeah. And I, I think that's where I'm going to just stop. Okay. Go ahead. All right. Jeremy, you have a lot. You have a lot, lot of lands. You have a I lot do. of mana. I do have a lot of mania. Um, what are the you cards you got? Uh, why you got so many? I do only have three cards in hand, but that could change at any moment here. Yeah. What, what, why? Well, don't, uh, don't change. Mainly, like, we go. right now. So I'm going to play Tazri for four. Because it costs one less because I have a warrior mm. in my party. That's nice. That's and nice. then I am going to activate its ability for blue, black, red, and green. Look at the top six cards in my library. I may reveal up to two cleric, rogue, warrior, wizard, and or ally cards from among them and put them into my hand. Put and or ally, the, huh? Yeah, put the rest on the bottom of they, my library in a random... Or I just know, about the words. But Tazri's not an ally. I'm really confused. Uh, well, not this one, no. Not that one. Yeah, that still doesn't make sense to me. Uh, so it's, I am it's going not a to player, player grab a wizard either. This Mina and Den Wildborn, which is an elf ally. Hmm. And I am going to grab this Arcanus the Omnipotent. Well, some of those aren't like well. the others. Which is a wizard card. Well. Those will go into my hand. I will yep. shuffle these up, put them on the bottom. I will play my Steam Vents tapped and pass the turn. Huh. You don't have more lands in there, do you? Yeah, I think if Steven and I combined our lands, we still have less than Jeremy. Yeah. I have I have eight. It's not really uh, right now. Now we have nine. Yeah. Now we would have nine. I'm gonna play Black Blade Reforge. Yeah. Uh oh. I'm going to equip Black Blade Reforge to Cherix. Nice. That's good. I'm, I'm going to attack John. And how big is your creature? Um, He is a 522. A 522, <laughs> 522. you said. Yeah. All right. All right. Oh, I, will, uh, I will block my yeah, 522. You don't, you don't want to let it through? I don't. Okay. Um, I'm done after that. 522. You heard him. My. All right. I'm going to play a Phyrexian Tower. I feel like this is Steven living his best life. What? What, are you talking about my 522? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> your, your big silly yeah. crab that can just get bigger. Uh, yeah. He's this, big is, this is dumb that these come into play tapped, but I'll do it anyway. I'm going to sacrifice... Uh, Dark Supplicant. And is that a Rogue's Passage I see on your side? Steve? It is a Rogue's Passage. That's what I played right there. That's a Rogue's Passage. Mana. I'm going to play Skyclave Relic with nice. Kicker. So when it enters the battlefield, it goes kick, create two tapped tokens that are a copy of it. 
It is weird that they're tapped. Yeah, it seems unnecessary, but... Well, no, you know, spent, no, spent no, six no, mana. No, you don't get it back. No, get out of here. You can't get half of it back. Yeah, ha- ha- heaven forbid for six mana. I mean, there's no way to copy tokens, right? That one's untapped. That one, yep. Just that one. Man. We can't... Uh... All right. I'm just going to say go then. Well. I'm going to draw... You know what I don't like? I'd like to just say this, not specifically to anyone, but just in general. I'm just going to throw you can it. You say out. it to Steven. No, it's not to Steven. I don't like that Marisi doesn't let us cast spells during combat. In the event that someone might want to do that, it doesn't let you, and I don't care for it. I have I have a crab Leviathan brain. All I know is squeeze. I'm going to play Sylvan Safekeeper. And draw a card of right. Guardian Project. Yeah, that's good, John. I'm going to play a forest, get a clue. Mm hmm. Uh, I'm going to play one, two, three, four, five, six. All I want. I'm going to play a Magus of the Candelabra and draw a card. Well, oh, that is a little That's, combination. Yeah, it actually isn't much of a combination, but it's fine. It gives your creatures vigilance. It does for for uh, paying X and it's tapping deep, X. Deep uh, I mean, you know, he needs a gas cradle. I don't have one of those in there. Benny Benny was responsible enough not to put that card in this deck. Oh, well, thank goodness for that. Thank goodness indeed. Yeah. Huh. Yep, it's uh, yep. Mm-hmm. John, you got you got a wealth of options. I don't, I don't have a wealth of options. Fingers. You have a guardian project. You're drawing at least one extra card every turn. I drew two cards. I played two one drops. I got both those cards. Wealth of options. How do those cards make you feel? They did not make me feel safe. I think he's under pressure. He's feeling the squeeze. He's feeling the squeeze a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. All right, I will. Since Steven's being a jerk and attacking me, I'm gonna attack him back for three. Ouch. That's right. How'd that make you feel, Steven? I bet that he destroys his own lands next turn. Uh next turn or right now? Oh, right now would be cool if you destroy all your lands. I ought to destroy all my lands. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, I don't know. I took my three, so oh. all right. I am <laughs> God. done. Oh man. Not even an orange reef onto those creatures. Yeah, I am. Ooh, Orin Reef. Mm-hmm. So, John, how, how safe are you feeling behind that Dust Bowl? Not. Play an island for the turn. Not at all. The opposite is safe. Opposite of no, safe. Because, like, if I... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use it, but yeah. I don't feel safe. If I, if I tap, don't I just get a... Yeah. Yeah, you're not. I'm going to do it on Jeremy's turn. you get the squeeze, though. Come on, man. No. I'm All sure right. you've got plenty of other ways to make it unblockable. I'm mainly doing this because I think it's funny to make Steven actually attack somebody else. So I'm going to attack Steven with Marisi. That was a terrible mistake, but I... Uh, no. Is it Trample? No, it's just a 5-4. It, so Marisi okay. just says when it deals damage that goads that player? Yeah, when it, when it deals combat damage uh, to a player, goad each creature that player controls. Each creature? Yep. That's fine. It is that one that one thing. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay. So five coming through at you. Um, Can't then... stop it. You're out of combat. I'm out of combat. I'm moving to my second. Man. All right. I'm dust bowling. <laughs> John's like, give me priority. I know Steven. He's already showed his intentions. I'm just gonna. If he has something else, yeah. he has something else. But that's what I got. So here we are. All right, and then I will pay the six to play the Arcanus. And then I good. will pass the turn after that. That's pretty good. Ancestral Recall on a card is pretty good. You know, it's, it's not here. bad, is what I've heard. Jeremy, how Did, are you doing on cards over there? Uh, I've only got three, which is... Oh, only three! Yeah. But you can draw two whenever you want. Yeah. 
I can look at the top six and probably draw two. You're going to draw two. Probably. And then when you untap, you could draw three more. Four more. I could. Six more if you activate Tazri. Uh, ponder. That's in Steven's budget this week. <laughs> it fit in last week. I know, I believe you. And Inferno Titan only cost 50 cents. It did. That's <laughs> no, 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 hate, okay? I'm not hating, I'm complimenting. I, you did such a good job looking for a high power and a low cost. Land, at least. Um, we'll play a solemn... Some al- some alacrum. Sad robot. Look at that. You got the card off you wanted off Ponder, and then you got rid of him anyways. How cute. That was a combination. It was a combo. Uh, I gotta attack you, John, and I'm gonna switch its power and toughness. Now, you don't have to attack me. Yes, I do, because... It's, it's uh, it is decided. I have to attack you. Not it true. does say attack uh, Jonathan Swartz. You killed Rudd's passage. You were uh, uh, afraid to gamble. You know? Uh, yeah, it wasn't, there I wasn't a gamble. Know. You were just going to kill me. I remember well, that. Now, I, what do you mean? How was I going to... I what, might not have. You would have. I mean... Well, you, you're getting pinched now. Yeah, I'm thinking. Give me a second. It's a... Um, 23-6 now? Yeah. A twenty thirty six. A twenty three six. Twenty three six. Yeah. You can almost kill it with your creatures. I cannot. Well, I mean, almost. But I cannot. He, he, he but, could say almost. Yeah, it's just almost though. Almost. You can't, but it's almost. Actually, the candelabra looks real dead. No, that one can let me do some silliness. So it might be Sylvan Safekeeper that's really dead. One of these two creatures is going to bite the dust. I'm trying to decide which one. I do like Sylvan Safekeeper. It's a sweet card. I know you do. I know it's emotionally you don't want to block with Sylvan Safekeeper. I don't. I don't. I was um, really, John, I definitely would have attacked Jeremy because he's got some shenanigans going on. But I know, but he's got this stupid, stupid shenanigans going on. It is very stupid. That's true. I could have just took him out, but you wouldn't let uh, me. Who, me? Yeah. No, don't even try that. <laughs> what? Um, man, I feel like I'm going to immediately regret blocking with this well, man. Yeah, whichever, the whichever, whichever one you do is going to be the wrong decision come your turn. Yeah, yep. almost certainly. That is how it works. All right, Magus, bite it. Yep. <laughs> Whatever you block with, whatever. Very, very strong grasp it had on that match. Whatever, sure whatever did. removal spell you use, yeah, man. just immediately was done. the wrong choice. I am done, yeah. All right. Get my three relics here. Draw a card. Well, I, I don't want to, you know, I'm not trying to pile on, but I am going to tag John for three with my life. What is going on? You can't <laughs> what is going on? Well. I just want my three life. Whatever, I'm taking it. Yeah, I'll, I'll gain. You haven't even taken any damage, John. Yes, yeah, Stephen, you're right. I sure haven't. <laughs> oh. Don't forget the commander damage, Kyle. Don't forget I'm gonna, it. I'm going to play uh, Mangara, the human cleric diplomat. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And I am going to play Ashnod's altar. Oh, boy. And then I have I have two floating. I'm done after that. You have floating mana? No, it's gone. Oh, sorry, not floating. I have two. Uh, I have two Skyclave relics that are. Untouched. How many cards do you have left? I have three. Yeah. Have you regretted your decision yet? No, not yet. I probably will later though. Mm-hmm. Ugh. All right, two, four. I kind of want to just cast my general in case Steven decides he wants to kill me. It's not a terrible idea. Uh, it's not a great one, but I don't know that I have much of an option. What do you mean? I, I can't kill anyone. I'm, I'm playing... Uh, what's, what's that card that makes him sack a creature every turn? That's, that's what you got. The, the abyss. abyss? Yeah, I have an abyss. A giant crab abyss. The crab abyss. Yeah. Somehow I don't believe you, though. 
Um, well, you shouldn't because I'm lying. Yeah. That's what I thought. Yeah. Well. Yeah, Jordan, right. There's just no telling what's going to happen. Oh, no. I have a feeling I know what's going to happen, so I'm just going to not lose my point. I'm going to play a Shia Soul of the Wild. Yep. Draw yep. cards from the Guardian Project. Yep. yep. Okay. Yep. Now all of your creatures are lands. Yeah. Forests. I'm going to play an Okina. Yeah, so many clues. Yeah, I have a lot of clues. I'm very clue heavy. Did you draw Three. a card off the Guardian Project as well? Uh, he, he did. He did. I did, yes. Yeah. Not for the Okina, but for my Ashaya, I did. Yeah, for the Ashaya. I just didn't miss, miss yeah. that part. Oh, that's three. I'm going to play an Eternal Witness to trigger the Guardian Project. I'm going to draw from Mangara. What is that? What What, what happened? What can you I do about that? Second, you cast your second spell every turn. Oh, boy. Here we go. Well, oh, no. I drew a card because of a white card. Somebody call R&D. <laughs> I'm going to return... Um... Well, they call them on Twitter. I don't know if you ain't noticed. I don't know if I want this Magus or this land. I guess that's the same thing, right? I'll I don't know if I want this Magus that's a land or this land that's a land. Well, I'm going to take the Magus and then I'm going to tap the Sylvan. I'm going to play the Magus and Guardian Project will draw a card. Pretty good. Yep. And now I will say go. All right. Now um, Jeremy draws two cards. Tazri. They are just put them into your hand, so. Yeah, they didn't draw them, Justin. Let's get it right. Look at six. No, no he wouldn't steal those away from him. Oh, See, you could, you whiff? Could, wow. could be zero. Did you whiff? Yeah. Could be several lands, yeah. That's unfortunite, Jeremy. Did, did it's not really whiff? a whiff. You also cleared them from the top of your yeah, library. Yeah, I, I just so. cleared, like, it was four lands. And, and, and two special. I would have much rather you had spells. just drawn those with Arcanus and not, All right. you know. Are you done? Uh well I'm going that was at the end of my turn. All right, I'm gonna cast Swords of Plowshares on Arcanus because I'm not gonna deal with that. Yeah, of course I'm you are. Gonna... Oh, really? excuse me. Yeah, what a Just what a Stephen make him pay for that surprise. Okay, surprise. Make him pay for that. He can't. He can't target my creature with it, so that's why he did it. He could. He could sack a creature and pay two. That'd be unwise. But he could have. Play my land for the turn. Then Why it's doing its do it? job. It's a message like it's supposed to. <laughs> yeah. That would have gained you a lot of life. I would put it right back in play, too. It's the best part. Six life. Um, That's exactly six life. Yeah. All right. I'm going to attack Steven with both of these so that he has to be goaded again. It has to deal damage, right? It has to deal damage. One, right? one of the creatures. It's whenever oh, really? a creature you control deals combat damage to a player. <sighs> So he can he can block and draw his card. I'm gonna block, yeah. Uh, yeah. I'll I'll uh, actually I'll take not your general damage. I'll take the other damage. Yeah. yeah so you're gonna take five from the Marisi. Yeah. Uh, and then I will. Play... I hate it. I hate it so much. I, I know. know you do. I know you do, John. I'll play Mean and Den Wildborn. Yep. And pass the turn. Party, party, party. Yep. That's what they're doing out there in Mina, the wild. Me and wild are, are, are wildborn, but they are not partying. Hey, tribute mage. Oh, that's true. They're just, they're allies. They're just allies. Tribute, so, tribute mage. mage. I may search my, for an artifact card with a burn my mana cost two or less. I will find Trailblazer's boots. First card. Two. Not, two, not two or less, by the way, just two. Oh, okay, just two. Well, I'll, I'll get Trailblazer's boots. Yep. Non basic land walk, you say? Yep. I'll, uh, I'm gonna cast Trailblazer's Boots. And I'm gonna equip Trailblazer's Boots on the chair. Yep. And I'm gonna switch his power and toughness and I'm gonna attack John. Again? Yeah. <laughs> now you don't have to do all this, Steven. Yeah. yeah, I do. I don't know what Justin can do with his four cards, but I, I, I'm i terrified of what you can do, so... We're I, only have three, I only have three cards, because I got oh, three cards. I uh, read uh, plus, Arcanus. Plus, he can't actually cast spells Hold on. during combat. No, well, he has to go to combat. Okay. So okay. he's moving to combat, is what you're Well, saying. he had to make it unblockable, because he has to do that, otherwise he's going to have to attack with he, it. So. He yep. put the boots on. He I put, put the, the boots, boots on. on. 
And he, right. he he put the boots on and he switched its power and tough. What does Maurice say? Uh, your opponents can't cast spells during combat. Whenever a creature you control deals combat damage to a player, goad each creature that player controls. Whatever. Well, I'm going to draw a card Stephen played. I do have four cards now. Sure. He played two spells. All right, Stephen. I'm going to uh, make a bunch of things untargetable. This one's untargetable. This one's untargetable. And I guess this one's untargetable. Oh, no, that's going to die anyways. And this one's untargetable. Stephen was right. Yep. And then I'll block with my Eternal Witness. Okay. I'm done. Oh, man. All right, on tap. I wish I had something cool to do, but I don't really. I'm going to play a Plains. Then I'm going to play a Whisper. Blood Liturgist. I wish I had something cool to do, but I don't really. Mean and Den is what? 4-4? Four, 4-4. Four? Four, four. Complain additional land. Red, green, return a land you control. Target creature you get. target creature gains trample until end of turn. And Ashaya is a 7-7. Seven, seven. Was an 11-11 and then that stuff happened. Ashaya is a, sorry, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah. 7 power. Thing is, so I want to gain life with my lifelink creatures, but I don't want to attack Steven. Well, I'm willing to block whatever creatures are smaller than 7-7. Seven, seven. That's why I'm also not going to attack you. Yeah. What I'm saying is I really want to attack Jeremy, but I can't because his his 4-4 four, four is bigger than all my clerics. Mm. And that I don't... That sounds like a clerical error. Mm. <laughs> Steven, you're so clever. I'm just going to say go. Just gonna hang out. Uh, you know, John, you just make Jeremy quit goat me. Um, you won't get attacked. I can't do that. So here we are. Yeah, he'll swing right at me with all of my non basics. Yep. Definitely won't attack the guy with just force to play. All right, I'm gonna play uh, even even wall tracker. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What are your lands? What are your creatures counting as? Basic force or non-basic force? What 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 do you mean? Well, all your creatures are lands. Are they basic lands or non-basic lands? Uh, they are all. That's a good question. No t- non-token creatures you control are force lands in addition to other types. So yeah, I guess they would be non-basic lands, which means I'm actually just dead because I would not have had a way to uh, to, to sacrifice a Shia. And I would not have been at will to block. No, Shy is a land, right? What's that? Shy is a land. Oh, yeah, Shy is a land. I would have to sacrifice the Shia. And your lands, I'm pretty sure. Just... Your basics and the Shia. Yeah, I would have to sec the basics and the Shia. The, non- uh, the non-basics. And the yep. Shia. No, you're right. I would have had to yeah, <laughs> sacrifice you're not, you're that. not dead. No, you're just, but I'm basically just, there. You're just doing bad. Yeah. Now you're doing real bad. Yeah, yeah. All right. Well, that changes what I'm going to do this turn. So, um, hmm. That definitely, definitely, definitely changes what I was going to do this turn. Yeah, you have a lot less mana now. I do, I do. I have like uh, five less, actually. Well, four less. Four less. Four less. Um, hmm. But you're alive. I am indeed alive. <laughs> I guess there's but that. you're alive. You're a vegetable, right. but you're alive. I'll still play the, uh, the Ubermall Tracker to draw a card. Yeah. That's not the one I need. Uh. Play a forest, get another clue. So many clues. So many clues. Been told to get a clue before, and I'm getting them. Two. I'll play a scavenging ooze and draw a card. I'll also draw a card. Yep. 
That Mangar card's obnoxious. I know. I've drawn three cards from it. The reason it's obnoxious is it would be obnoxious if it was red or black or green or blue. It would be obnoxious. Just trying to live um, over here, homie. Okay. <laughs> Just trying to live. Yep. All right. I I am uh, done. All right. Tazri. See if we get another whiff. I hope you do. Well, I've got a wizard and an ally here. Marchesa the Black Rose and Drana Liberator of Malakir. Well. It was almost a whiff, though, because this was three lands and a non-land. That's not what I qualify as almost a whiff. Almost a whiff. During John's end of turn, I'm going to cast Anguish on Making, and I'm going to exile your Marisi. Because I'm, I'm tired of Steven being goaded. Bad idea. Was it? Yes. Yeah, probably, but what else is new? Here we are. What else is new? I'm going to land for the turn. That's a bad idea. For, bad for Jeremy. It's good for me. Bad idea. Well, Jeremy will only die at random, so, you know, he's got that looking for him. If no one, no one goaded me, I just might have to attack at random, just lash out. Wildly lash out. Yep. Love to lash out at John again, but he's assembled quite a little army of squirrels. Icing creatures. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I'm ready, I'm ready to do this. Yeah. I'll cast Drana. You know you could yeah. kill Steve Justin at any point in the game. You've just chosen not to. Um I'm the peacekeeper. I'm the clerk. No, yeah, cast that's it. March Chesa. I'll draw a card. And then I will pass the turn. I'm not goaded. You're not can't goaded. be goaded anymore. I so. made sure of that, Stephen. I made sure. I know, but goaded. it's not like you can get out of the randomonium if I put you in there. Maybe yeah. for maybe. What about Stephen? What about for just this turn? Just it's this turn. The, yeah, just this turn. It's as, not the randomonium. As, as an olive branch for uh -huh. for me ungoading you because Jeremy was 100 percent going to attack you again. Steven, if, you, if you do that, Whispered then becomes live and he doesn't care anymore. Why wouldn't I care? Why would you care? What? I'm just going to sacrifice the creature block you. with Factor Fiction. I can't block. I have. I can't get rid of my lands. John, I'll choose you for Factor Fiction. Oh boy. You got to flip those face up for me. <laughs> is that a glass pool mimic? Uh, there's a glass pool mimic there. There's a lightning greaves, a nykthos, an island, and an aqueous form. Oh, aqueous form that makes it okay. Uh, aqueous form versus the rest. Um, it's a lot of value. Aqueous form. Yeah, rightfully so. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna put aqueous form on Cherix. Um. Hmm. How do we determine who gets it? Even or odd? No, Justin, you're in on it. You have to be. I yeah. made you being able to attack that's, anyone. That's true, but you still have to be included. Um, I, don't, I don't have to be included. I, uh, you're choosing. Man, how do I do it? I don't have the faces. I need the faces, Kyle. You have a die. <laughs> I have one die. What, yeah, well, okay, one, two, okay. three, four, five, six. Okay, Justin's one, two, John's three, four, and right. Jeremy's five, six. Here we go. It was one, two. No, oh, come on. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, all that mana, Justin. What you going to do with it? I'm going to cast Deadly Rollick. I'll oh, pay two to target your commander. see that one coming. I'll swan song. Uh, no, Steven. Ooh. I let you attack without being goaded. And this is how you repay me. He's giving you a bird. Give He's you a bird. Block. I'm going to draw a card. I need to scrap one. I can't block. If well, I, I'm not saying that you can't. I'm just saying you that. You cast your general this week. You now have a, you now have a swan to use. I'm dead. 
Yeah, I'll go I'm ahead. I have to. Yeah, I have to do the swaparoo. So I'm dead now. Swaparoo. Right. The old swaparoo. Yeah. So it's a twenty-five-eight. <laughs> you know, I figured that my chances were better to live. That's that why Marisi, I randomed it. I that Marisi was gone because. You know, at least it gave it, you another another roll of the die. Someone else. It gave me it gave me another uh, another seventeen percent chance. See, I'm, I'm likely done. to die right after you. Yeah, I'm done. All right, uh, end of your turn. I'm going to activate. Do you have a creature in your graveyard? Me? Yes. Should, should you yes. kill, kill Jerry? Right, I'm going to eat it with my scavenging news. Uh, I have a glass pool mimic and a solemn. I'll take your glass pool mimic. Yep. And then I'll take your solemn too, I guess. Actually, sorry. Um, I'm, just, I'm not actually I'm not gonna actually do either of those. I'm just trying to figure out how you had that much mana untapped. I, I played a scavenging use last turn, Joe Steven. And a ball tracker? That cost one. Get it absolutely nothing. <laughs> yeah. I did yeah. two, three. Yeah, yeah, you're right. I'm, I'm sorry. All right. I'm not actually gonna exile this, Steven. You can keep them. I'm actually gonna sack a clue because I have five of them over here. Smart. Yeah, I would rather cards right now. Hey, oh, that Tyler's tracker gets the life. counter. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna gain the life. I'm just gonna draw the card. All right, you're all done, Stephen. Yes, sir. What Justin, mean, it's your Steve, turn, what right? Mean, what do you mean, is Stephen all done? Yeah, all right. I was just making sure it was your turn, Justin. I'm gonna go ahead and just skip you real quick. Draw. Real quick, he says. Un- unbelievable. Just disrespect across the board. Stephen, you have a okay. million islands, right? Total no, no, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven islands. Seven. Yeah, I try to do things. So Cherix gets for everybody. It's That's a zero right. seventeen. It so could become a uh, the first activation uh, seven ten. The second Got activation it. would be a fourteen three. If I Got don't it. do anything, if the black blade's not there. Got it. Oh, but I mean, uh, if I activate it once, it, 10 7 is probably what it will end up like if I swapped it. I don't no, know. that's good. I was just curious. Yeah, curious. All right, so that gives me that. That gives me not quite what I need. At least you're alive, John. Yeah, treasure, treasure. I am alive. Here's the problem uh, I'm not necessarily alive next turn. Jeremy and should I'll be the one that's dead. That's not true at all. That Jeremy's not dead, Jeremy's or that I might not be alive next turn. I Jeremy's might be dead, dead, so you might need to figure it out. How much? I am not able. To be. So your Cherix is tapped. First off, let's clear that up. Yeah, sorry, it is. It is. Get that out of there. <laughs> uh, let's clear I that. Try, I wouldn't try to block with it. it. Doesn't matter. Yeah. You know what? I just want to make sure it's gone. That's all. I'm trying to think of what I can do just, here. Just starts untapping them all willy nilly. Here's my swan. You're welcome. Thanks. I had it for three seconds. Hey, listen, I feel, I do feel slightly bad. You know, you helped me and, and then I bit you. Just like last week. But I'm a I, mindless crab. No, no, no. Last week, don't even start. You deserved it. Okay. Last I'm week playing Castle Garen Brig. I was if talking about first blood. Yeah, if anyone deserved to die this week, it's John for bringing his scum infinite combos. So instead, you killed the, well, the, I, the you, blue you, collar. Cleric, yeah. I'm still upset about you infinite me. It was your card, you yeah. To, to be me. clear, no one has infinite you yet, but about Justin. So, yeah, Justin, I, that was a random only effect where, where, where infinites are allowed, not a regular episode <laughs> where infinites are allowed. Yeah, so what, I, is, what is happening right now? Where the I'm combos to come out. to play, okay. yeah. the randomonium. And look at the look at the infinite I gave you in the randomonium. In case the game it's the same cards. It's the same cards. It's the same cards. I use the same cards. All right, I'm, the paying, exact same cards. I'm getting six man. I'm gonna play Karn Silver Golem uh, and draw like a Guardian that Project. At all. Um, so I have one floating currently. With not something I want to do. Um, well, that's an hmm. interesting card you got there, John. It's not a bad card. I know it is not a bad card. It's a very good card, actually. It's not a bad one. Um, I have one floating and not much to do with it. Wish you had that last turn. 
I do too. I did have it last turn. I didn't have the mana to activate it as well. Uh, with the one mana on it, I'm going to uh, make Steven's Blackblade Reforge a 2-2. Two -two. Yep. Uh, I can't realistically attack. I guess I could attack my, my Tireless Tracker into both your cards. That's not horrible. My Scavenging Ooze to trade. That's not horrible. We know exactly what you're doing, so just get it over with. Yeah. It's just Tireless Tracker, it looks like. Uh, yeah. Steven, I'll, tire, Tireless Tracker. I'll, I'll block with Black Lady Forge. Okay. Sneaky. Well, you, All right. I'll let you fight it? We're not doing it. Come on. Uh, well, it does take two mana to fight. Dur, 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 dur. I'm sure you got it. Sure. Yeah, whatever. All right. Jeremy, go ahead. All right. I will activate Tazri. Six. Does take two mana to fight. That's it true. It does. It does. Currently, I only have one. Warrior I got that Elven Spirit guy rogue. here, though. Currently, you only have a forest, is what you're saying. Uh, yes, currently. Thieving Skydiver and Kazool Tyrant of the Cliffs. No way to get two mana. Am I missing something? Hmm? I don't think so. Oh, yeah, Shy's not in play. Yeah, duh. Yeah. <laughs> if I had a Shy, I would have a, a lot of mana. You have Justin. a lot of mana, that's true. But I don't have that. Into... Into I'm working without a Shy right now. What was that second one? You got Kazool and then what? What was the blue one? Uh, thieving the new Skydiver. Thieving Skydiver, the one oh, that has hey Kicker on. and can gain control of target artifact. Hey, that's not a that's not a legendary creature, Jeremy. I said there were a few non-legendary creatures I know. in here. Well, but you, you didn't make it clear, so I think you should just concede. Ah, uh, sure, sure. No, I get that. Mm -hmm. Totally understandable. I played uh, only clerics. You sure showed them. I yep. did. All, all the way to fourth place. Hmm. <laughs> I feel like I'll be reclaiming my um my my pole position next week. How much does the do the uh Trailblazers boots cost? Two mana. Two mana. Okay, so this would cost four. Alright, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna Thieving Skydiver stealing the Trailblazers boots. Yep. Oh, it attaches it too. Okay, I was like, I was throwing up there. Jeremy, yeah. what search a... do you have? What search do you have saved? Is there a search on Scryfall that says, um, "Use other people gain control in my yeah in my Just deck. gain control of target." Now he has, he has a been... Trailblazers boots he has attached saved to a thieving skydiver. He has it saved yeah. under the bo bookmarks. Helpful cards for webcam magic. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, you're not wrong. Um, all right, so I have warrior, wizard, rogue, so I have three. So that turns party, party. We this. like party. I'll just use these because we still have prismatic omen. Uh, coveted prize just becomes just straight up demonic tutor. Yep. Does not have a full party, so I can't cast a cost four or less because I don't have True. the cleric in there. Don't have the cleric. Shucks. I know where you could find some of those, but they're all dead now. Yep. Um, they're exiled. They come back from the dead, Justin. They would have. No, he's right. They're exiled. Their whole lineage was eradicated. It's true. <laughs> they're not going to come back. Okay. I think what I want to do is grab this what is that one i bet it's a good one it's a card that's going to go into my hand without showing you uh oh it's gum he's never going to cast it you heard it here he's never going to show you never he's just ever gonna sit, just going to sit in his hand going to show you i bet he's going to show me right now together me? uh i would like to move to combat i would also like to move to combat jeremy would all we'll always get what we want you're going to no, get what you want. Right no now. objections on my side, Jeremy. Yeah, you good. I would like to 
clear all attacks at Steven, who is definitely going to kill me. I can't kill you. Yet. Yeah. What do you mean? I can't, I can't do anything with Karn in play. I don't trust you. You randomly threw your Black Blade Reforged away. I'm sure you got something. Throw it away. You're just going to kill it. I'm not going to get yeah. it. I sure was. Um, so I have. I'll block your general damage with the Tribute Mage. All right. So, I, well, Drana hit. Throne, right? Drana hits. For, they all do have dethrone, but I'm on the highest right now, so that's. He's on the throne. I'm on the throne. on the throne. But I do have Drana. Well, that needs to change. Which is going to put a plus one, plus one counter on each of these. I got bad news. So, Steven you. takes two from Drana. Two from Drana. And then, and then the then rest. Each attacking creature, yeah. So, it's going to be four. And then, so nine total, because he's going to block the, the command. Tazri damage. still gets the counter. Tazri still gets the counter, yes. Yeah. Because it's just attacking creatures. Uh, and then I will pass the turn. All right, Steven. Give him the bingo bango. The proverbial crab body bag. We can't do that. Give him the squeeze, Steven. We can't. There's no squeezing to be had. Shiny, where's it at? Can't kill him. So many islands, though. So many islands. You know what was a good card, Justin? Karn. Silver Golem. Karn was. It came slightly too late. Well, for someone. Probably slightly too late for me, too, but the exact time it had to be there for me. Yeah, I wish it had come uh, one turn earlier. Yeah, you had tried to argue out of my saving point, though, so... Not, not unless you were saving me. I would have said, Scrum's great. <laughs> <laughs> There's Steven's favorite deer. <laughs> he just can't get away. He's played it every single week. <laughs> it's the only card Loves that's that made deer. his deck every single week. That elk Burn deer heart. heart. I'm going to inscription of insight. I'm going to ask you card. I'm going to no. It's it, you're. I hate your it's card. Not, it's not good for now, but it's you a sweet this card. It's really bad against your card in play. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna scry two, draw two. It's awful. Sorcery so, speed. It's so awful against that <laughs> safety. Like, oh my goodness. Yeah, but I mean, if you would have just returned two creatures, that'd have been really good. No, it, I mean, it won't you won't let it happen? So was it? No, I will not. No, I will not. I will not. You've made me sacrifice four lands this game already, Steven. <laughs> no, 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 no. I didn't make you do anything. That's a choice you made. It's not. Um, you're up, John. Uh, the end of your turn, do you, st- you still have creatures? Attack? So I'm going to go ahead and eat a creature. And get away. He's got to pay mana to swap that guy around or tap his other guy. Yeah, I, don't, I only have two mana. Well, I can't, am I going to kill it? Pay mana. Because right. he, the black bed's dead. Couldn't he took my equipment away? You can swap it with your your Thurmurgadr. Thurgadr. Thurgadr. Pay three mana to create a power, or it just kills itself. Um, what's potato, potato. Yeah, yeah. And then if I made it uh, a seven ten and then swapped it into a ten seven, that's not. We're not doing much with that. Well, why did you kill me? <laughs> Six. I could have helped you. I'm gonna cast a Shia. It could have been a team, the classic team of crabs and clerics. Um, the seas, the seamen. Yeah. Do you get it? Shia that was resolved. a really good joke. Uh. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna draw a card for Guardian Project. Uh, I'm gonna make a la- a token for Tireless Tracker because it comes in as a land. Because for some True. reason that's ridiculous huh. among other things being ridiculous among other, among other things i'm gonna play a let's see i have i have mana now i have the manas i have the mana i play blighted woodland so many clue tokens i have to sacrifice somewhere so many clues so many um 
Hmm. So one, two, three, four mana. If I leave these guys around, these can be sacked from me or not sacked, but tapped. I want these guys to hang around. So what kind of nonsense are you getting up to here? I think I just want I just need more land because I've I've put so many away, you know. So Sure, yeah. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do one one two I wanna keep that one open in case anybody does something silly. Malcolm disagreed with your assessment. Sure. Three. I'll play a far heavy man elf. Uh, okay, now two lands. So I'm gonna go get a land. One tapped, one untapped. Tapped. I'm gonna get a clue, and then I'm gonna draw a card. So I get a land here. Did you get two clues? Did your far heavy elf in there? get two. I do get a clue now. Yeah, I get a clue again. John, what are you gonna do with all them clues? I mean, I if Stephen was attacking me with all draws, he gotta be sacking them. But he's not, so I don't know. That's last week. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'm going to draw a card for the Guardian Project. Uh, that leaves me with four. No, it leaves me with three mana currently. Because the Shia is sick. Well, you have, you have a Blighted Woodland down there. Four. Blighted Woodland. You are right. Yep. What about that Woodland now? Um... But I'm not going to do anything with it. I'm going to tell Jeremy to go. Shy is a 15-15, is that right? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 15, 15. All right, Tazri, under your turn. Bigger oh, than a gets... crap that I know of. It's a not. Warrior it's and... not. Crap's got more toughness. For now. Warrior and a rogue. Edric, Spymaster, Trust and Wrist the Redeemed. Ah, that famous that famous warrior, Wrist the Redeemed. Yep. Makes elf warriors. Known for his warriorness across the land. And that famous rogue Edric. That is a famous rogue. Very roguish. Mm-hmm. Alright, so I'll pay three and I will play Rada, Heart of Keld. That's a warrior. Now, Rana has a, a six-man activation ability, right? Correct. Plus X, plus X, where X is the number of lands you control. And I will Thanks. also play Edric, Spymaster of Trest. And I'll look at the top card of my library. Too. And I will move two attacks. That's okay. Objection here. What's your objection? No, No objection here. Oh, okay. Do you have any reach creatures, Suarez? Uh, as far as you are aware, no, not currently. Yeah. I do, however, have an Uvenwald tracker that can fight creatures. He does have non-basic lands, though, Jeremy. I just want to point I that do out. have those. Yeah, that is what I was going for here. You do have non-basic lands. And I will swing Drana at Steven and uh, Thieving Sky Dancer at Mr. Jonathan Suarez. So you're attacking me for two? Two. Well, it'll end up being three because Drana will flying, play plus one. Flying non basic land walk. Yep. It is only a two one. It. Yeah, if you want to. I have thought fight. about blocking it. I'm not going to pretend that I haven't. Um, but I'm not going to end up blocking it. So here we are. Right. Steven, I assume you're not blocking either. I can't block. All right. So you're not blocking. Now, now all attacks. your creatures get it, even the ones all, that only, didn't attack? Only, atta only attacking creatures. Yep. Okay, I was about to say, wow, that card's really good. Nope, I completely forgot. Yep, only attacking all creatures. Right. So, uh, you will take three, three, Stephen, and then John will take three as well. Drana's only three power now? Uh, Drana is a four, five. Got it, but the three damage was what hit him. So, all right, so we three damage three. is what. Yep, three damage hit, and then plus one, plus one counter on each attacking creature after it deals the combat damage, so. Got it. Yep, and then this becomes a three, two. Before... Uh, regular yep. damage comes through. And then you three. have some Edric abilities triggering. And then I have two Edric triggers. <laughs> and I will pass the turn. 
Don't let me be the only victim. There's nothing to count on. I told you. I'm counting on you is what I'm counting on. So do what? I can't attack through Karn. I'm hoping you're going to figure it out. I don't want to be let down. You can't attack through what? Through Karn. Karn? Why not? I it's can't unblockable. Equip, I can't equip my creature. With what? Yeah, I don't have any equipment. I mean, if you're not attacking me, you can equip it. You can do whatever you want to do. Yeah. T.I. said it best. You John, can do whatever. That's okay, John. I'm going to play a Sword of Feast and Famine. Now, now, Stephen. You, you literally use the words, if I'm not attacking you, I can do whatever I want. This is, I, I did say that. I, do I did say that. I did say that. That is, that is a thing that happened. Those are the words I said, and I will live by them. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to equip uh, this Cherix with uh, Sword of Feast of Fame. Protection from green and from black, eh? Yep. And unblockable? Uh, that is correct. Thanks to Aquarius. So how how big is the uh the unblockable pro green pro black Leviathan crab? Two nineteen. Two nineteen, huh? Yeah. Shucks. It's not quite big enough, you know. It's not, unfortunately. I was really hoping to be big enough. It's not there. It's not. All right. It's equipped. Just uh, yeah, I'm thinking now. We'll go to attackers. Like all the things I'm hearing. Um, I want to yeah. attack John so bad, but... I mean, uh, you no attack way. me, it's just not going to be equipped it anymore. Not, it would not work out. Yeah. Attack Jeremy, he dies. So, okay, you know. I'll take John. Now, why would you do that? Oh, well, well, this just got a little more interesting. I'm a fan. So how big is it? 219. Simple Country 219. Oh, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> it becomes a 10 11. Uh, I don't know All what's right. going to happen. I'll animate your short piece of so, so far. I'll, uh, I'll target this to swap its power and toughness. I'll respond. How big is it right now? <laughs> 219. 219 with that on the stack. It won't matter once what when it checks out that result resolution will still be seventeen power. So, um, Stephen, I'm gonna let you walk that back because your creature's gonna die. Because your creature's gonna instantly die when the equipment goes off. Unless I pay three mana to stop it. Right. Then you need to do it now. I don't need to do it now. You haven't taken the equipment off. Is the equipment? I've activated. And okay. I'm not... Is this going through? This right here. If if it does, you're not gonna like it. All right, that goes through, sure. Okay, now it's a 19 2. Yeah. Yep. So, Karn's ability is still on the stack. Yep, let's resolve okay. it. I gave you the chance to walk this back. Now it's gone. Karn's ability is still on the stack. Calm down. All right. It's on the stack. <laughs> I've, I'm calm. Cucumber calm. You can tell my mono green deck over here. Cucumba. Yeah, it did. All right. All right. That's that putting it, it in the graveyard. Uh, it doesn't matter. And then your aqueous form falls off, right? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't animate that. I actually gotta do this. I don't you you do still get to scry. You did attack. You that chose was, me for some reason instead. That was that was the resolution of all this. That sure was. All right, I'm going to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. All right, Jeremy, how much do you have open right now? A, a million mana? Uh, how many cards? A million cards? I have seven cards in hand, and I have six mana open, yeah. All right. Uh, si seven cards in hand, you said? Seven cards in hand. Seven. Seven. That's more than I wanted Sorry. to see. Um, Drew a couple hmm. extra from Edric. Sure. sure. Me and him are buddies. Hey, man. Do, you have, do you have any creatures in your graveyard? In my graveyard? No. I have Farseek, Skystride Claim, and Coveted Prize as my graveyard. All right, that's fine. I'm going to draw a card. Uh, my only creatures were exiled. John, you guys your infinite combo yet or not? No, Steven, I told you it's not just all infinite combos. It, it I mean, it looks Are really you like sure? you don't need much to get an infinite combo going. I have, I have 11 permanents in play that are non-lands, and none of them cause an infinite combo yet. Yeah, yet. 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 Yeah. Well, I'm sure that Candelabra can help you somehow. It has to. It, it can. 
<laughs> kick. Yeah. Steven, I'm still rooting for you, even though I died at your little crabby hands. Yeah. There's how much no power and toughness do you currently have? Or how much toughness do you have, Jeremy? Power and toughness. That's available. I have a 3-3, three, three, a 2-2, two, two, a 4-4, four, four, a 5-5, five, five, and a 5-7. John, I'm going to extend an olive branch. I have a way to interact with two creatures in my hand. I don't need I don't need your olive branch. Two wow. creatures. I don't need your olive branch. Either. The olive branch just... You've lost your your olive branches are gone. Okay. You can interact with two creatures, you say. Yep. All right. I'm going to play a land, make a clue. I have a very very big Ashaya. Um 2 4 I'm going to play Boom Pile. Now, Boom Pile says, tap, flip a coin, because, you know, I love some chaos. Yeah. Of course, though, I probably don't have a coin, so we're going to have to flip a, uh, a die. Uh, if you win the flip, destroy all non-land permanents. I hear that's pretty good. Wait. Ah, Justin's figured it out. All right, hold on, hold on. It's so, okay. So, I will. if you turn... Boom pile into a creature with Karn. Ah, he's figuring it out. It's in a land. And then because it's a land, you can untap it with Magus the Candelabra, but you can also untap Magus the Candelabra with Magus the Candelabra. You've established it, Justin. I figured it out. (laughs) Uh, Jeremy, how about boom pile? How do you feel about it? I don't feel good. I'm wondering. I can't respond after you flipped the coin, right? Uh, no. The tap is the. You can respond to the tap ability, but that is all. Okay, that's fine then. All right. Puppets so, vertical over again. I'm sorry. So it's puppets vertical over again, except you can yep. bring it out this time. Yep. Now, see, Justin. The key here is that if I make it a creature, it's then summoning sick. This turn. This turn. Yeah. Um, so there's that. You can still tap it once before that. Oh, I can time. definitely tap it. Don't get that confused. He's still yeah. 50-50 this turn, but next turn, he's those odds go up. Way, way up. Like, all the way up. Like, guaranteed, almost, if you will. Yeah, it's pretty un- pretty unlikely it would not be. Well, I just keep doing it until I hit, until I hit it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that sounds right. So, uh, we have a 50-50 shot this time. I like 50-50 shots. Does anybody else like 50-50 shots? What do you mean keep doing it? I'm confused. Well, how did you keep doing it until you hit it? Doesn't it have to resolve after you flip the coin? Yeah, but if I lose, it doesn't do anything. Because he'll just untap it and do it again. Because he has yep. the Magus. Then it would be a land. So he can untap the land and then untap the Magus because the Magus is also a land. And then also untap the Jorga Tree Speaker, which makes two mana. Which re-nets See, all just the Just running through it all for you. There you go. Yeah. You could read Benny Smith's article if you really want to know how it works. I didn't um, read it. I just, I just. You just figured it out. Figured it out. All right. I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to activate Boom Pile and retain priority. I'm going to. Uh, animate it. Okay. Animation happens. So I it is will. now. It is now a four. Tough power and toughness forest creature. Okay. I will... With a flip a coin trigger ability on the stack. Just to make sure that it's all kind of fair-ish. Oh. In that you don't get to keep all your stuff and all of our stuff goes away. I'm going to Venser your Ashaya. Well, you're going to attempt to Venser my Ashaya. I'm going to attempt to Venser your Ashaya back to your hand. All right, so you're casting Venser. Yes. Steven, I assume you have no problem with that resolving. I smelled it. Cool. Steven's yeah. been waiting for this Venser for, for 12 episodes. <laughs> for, yeah, yeah, I was just saying for a season oh, one. Yes. 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 I've been waiting for it, yeah. So I'm going to I'm gonna add a colorless man in my mana pool, mm-hmm. and then I'm going to sacrifice this Blighted Woodland to my Sylvan Safekeeper to give a Shia uh, Hexproof until end of turn. Okay. Excuse me. Uh, Shroud. Shroud, specifically. Shroud. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. Okay, okay, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Maybe I want to do something about that. I don't. I'm gonna okay. do. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna do this. Second yep, burn chart. Yeah. Yep. Smart. Smart. I like it. So, uh, 
you know, in case he wins the flip, I guess. Are we prepared for the flip? I was born ready. Flip, flip. I did have the flip from uh, from the last two. All right, here we go. There's a heads. All right. There's a tails. Head makes everything goes boom. Tails, nothing happens. Here we go. Tails, nothing happens. Anti-climatic. No. Oh. I like it. What was that, Steven? No, nothing happens. I'm dead. Are you? Yeah. I'm Are at 15. You? I mean, I can count. Can you? No How are you going to just wait to Jeremy from beating my head in on his turn? Maybe maybe Jeremy doesn't care about beating your head in. Sure. Maybe uh, your head is not the head he wants to beat in, Stephen. Yeah, but I feel like he might struggle to beat in the proper head. Well, but he's going to ultimately need to beat in that head if he wants to be the ultimate head beater. <laughs> there's too many heads being beaten here. Yeah, 1, correct. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Yep, 16 mana. Checks out. Uh, well, I'm not worried about the mana necessarily. Yeah, it's, a six, it's, it's a 16. It's 16. The, the 16 16 coming at Stephen Green. Uh, I will attempt to rapid hybridization. It, it has shroud. Oh, I'll turn. Attempt to rapid hybridization your Sylvan Safekeeper. Wait. Okay. There's a there's a there's a way. You so mean I Sylvan Safekeeper? I don't want to live. <laughs> All right, so Sylvan Safekeeper is being targeted then. Yeah. All right. Um. I don't want to live. I don't want to <laughs> live. All right. All right. I will. Uh, yeah. Sure. You don't have a Trailblazer's boots anymore. That's going yes. out of here. It is. I just uh, wanted to play this card tumble, but your deck is a scum deck, John. Yeah, I know. It's very scummy. Don't let right me now. target anything. You're scummy. Uh, you, you can target what? anything you want that's not mine. Uh, you know that deck wasn't a scum deck, Steven. It was uh, yours, but he, he survived by luck, Justin. Luck. What I'm hearing is you he called Benny Smith decision. scummy. Yeah, yeah, that's you exactly what he said. To kill me. Pretty ridiculous. Honestly. You heard it here first. Uh, you can draw a card, John. <laughs> I get to draw a card from my rogues dealing damage. From, or my from, creature dealing damage. Your creature dealing damage. All right. Excellent. I like that. Now, Jeremy, you have quite a bit. Here we are, Justin. Do here I do have are. a little bit going on? Two. Will you take bets on how long it takes these two to 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 settle up here. The the sea men both dead. Shouldn't shouldn't take too long. Honestly. Um, all right. I'm going to pay. I'm going to play Shadow Spear. Mm -hmm. And I think that's where I'm probably going to stop. Let's see. Nah. Let's play a Voyaging Seder as well and draw a card and make that. All right. You're still in Safekeeper, still around, right? It is. It's still oh, around. Oh, it's. Jeremy, oh. you're going to lose to that card. Go. Ahead, Jeremy. A hundred percent. There is a good chance I am going to lose to Sylvan Safekeeper. Yep, you needed a crescent grip, my friend. Um. All right. Well, that's not a crescent grip. Yeah, I don't, the crescent grip's not going to save me now. <laughs> we needed it. Um. When he played Karn, so that it would just he would just die. If I would have lost that boom pile, if I would have won that boom pile flip, I would have lost more permanents combined than the two of you. It's true. It's true. I don't weird. even know what you would have lost. There's ten oh. clues down here. Oh, the clue. Oh, no one cares. How could we forget? Oh, uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah, the, the clues the are clues the problem. You've drawn, you, what have you cracked? One of them? I've cracked. All right. uh, there's two counters on Tyler's tracker, okay? All right, so you have... You haven't even lost. You just made Tyler's tracker get plus ten, plus ten. True. That would have been huge. All right. Uh, Jeremy, you're asking what I have mana-wise? Yeah. What do, you, what do you have untapped? Yeah. Untapped, not summoning sick, are these five creatures. And a Castle Garen Brick. And a Tylus Tracker. Let me move that up to the front. <laughs> all I have yeah. untapped is all of my permanents. Not all, but close. This is untapped, but, not, but is sick. Right. I can generate a lot of mana. I can generate one, two, three, four, five, six. And I can untap X lands. Which yeah. happened to be any of the permanents he has. Yeah, Draga adds an additional one, but... Okay, all right, yeah. I get that, I get that. 
Well, yeah. Does does Rada get the trample? Rada gets plus X plus X, does not get the trample, but Got I do it. have a Mina and Den, which can give it to trample. I know. Got it. Which is pretty good from my end of things. Jeremy, I'm going to go out on a limb and say, this is your last turn to do anything meaningful. Um, I'm going to go out on a limb and say what you need is the card Stifle. <laughs> stifle? What's that going to do? Stop you from fighting him? You need Trick Mind is what you need. Yeah. yeah. Stifle trick trick mind will do it. Stifle won't do it. Trick mind will do it. He'll just untap it and do it again, Steven. Yeah. So all your creatures are lands, which is bad. Um, yes. It's very bad. All right. I will move two attacks. Okay. I'm going to declare these as attackers currently. All right. Um, currently nothing. What does Mina and Den say? It is, uh, you may play an additional land, and then red-green, return a land you control to its owner's hand. Target creature gains trample until end of turn. Got it. Well, the encounter's happening? Because that happens right now. Uh, well, first strike damage has to happen. It's not just attacking, Steven. I thought, I thought she got it from attack. She has to deal damage? Yes. She okay. has to deal damage, yes. Toronto has to deal damage. Um... So I can't. I don't have any flyers, so I technically can't block that. Uh, your Rada is a two-two. Can't block it. It is a three-three. Three-three. Yeah. Farhaven Elf will jump in front of a Rada. Hmm. How many lands do you have? A million. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Right now. And it costs six to activate that. It does cost six to activate that. All right, uh, Rada will jump in front of, or excuse me, Farhaven Ape will jump in front of Rada. I was like, Rada's doing the running down. They keep be jumping in front of themselves. Yeah. And I'm not blocking the flyer, so you can go ahead and get through first strike if you're ready, whenever you're ready. All right, so first strike happens. All my attacking I take I take four from first strike. Yep, you take four from first strike. Farhaven Elf's dead. No, Farhaven Elf is not dead yet. Why not? Because does Rada, Rada have first strike? Regular... Yeah, Rada yeah. has first strike when it's attacking. Does it not? Oh, okay. Ah, yeah, if it is, as long as it's your turn. Me. Yep, yep, yep. All right. So Farhaven Elf has died from first strike, then. Uh, well. Or well, those counters aren't on there. One or the other. Yep, that's fine. All right. Farhaven Elf is gone, and I'm now taking uh four from Skydiver. Four in the air. So I draw a card, and then I draw another card. Yep. Exotic Orchard. So exotic. So exotic. So I will. Oh dear. Um. Pass the turn. Yeah. Um. What's your biggest creature that's untapped right now? Untapped biggest creature is probably Tazri, which is a five seven. Okay. Um. Let's make a Shia fight your your Tazri. How big is a Shia right now? Real big? Like 15 or more. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10 11, 12, 13, 14. So 5, 10, uh, 15. 15. No, 14, because this is not a, not a thing. All right. I'm going to Nyambi, S, esteemed speaker, bounce it back to my hand and gain 5 life. So when it comes, when Nambi comes into play, it just when it enters the battlefield, you may return another target creature you control to its owner's hand. If you do, you gain life equal to that creature's converted mana cost. Got it. And then it also has one blue white d- tap, discard a legendary card, draw two cards. Okay, like that. that's cool. That's a neat one. All done. A little tricky trick there. Done after that, I think. I'm gonna tap two. I'm gonna suck a clue, draw a card. Uh, okay. Untap. All right. How Pretty much sure just toughness dead do you have now? Uh, I have a five, a four, a two, a two, and a one. What does that equate to? Uh, five, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen total. Hmm. Hmm. Why don't you just blow everything up now, John? 
Well, because now I don't want my shadow spear to die, and I want to be able to equip it. And well, make your shadow spear a creature. But then, then I can't equip it, Stephen. Yeah, but the, it survived until next turn. Sure. Just get your boom pile going, John. Get I do want to get my boom. I do want my boom in to go. Boom. Yeah. Metro That's, booming, if you will. I'll seems play like land. what you really want to do is boom. No, no. Yeah, you ever heard that song? I want you in my room. Is that how it goes? Um, yeah, that's the, that's the song right there. Got it. Two. I want to play Steven's favorite card, Black Bleed Reforged. Hey, now. That one's real good. I remember uh, that. My soul's in it. Yeah. Yeah, well, that, I don't feel matter. good about this, but I'm going to mana drain that Black Bleed Reforged. Uh, <laughs> feel pretty good about it. Mana drain? Yeah, mana drain. That's pretty good. Got two manas. Well, yuck. That's not what I wanted to see happen. All right. Um, all right, Jeremy. Something much bigger than that, but you got it. No, that would have been really good because I have Shadow Spear, which gives Trample and Life Link, and that would have just killed you. But yep. now we're going to do the fun stuff. Now we're going to boom. Break real quick. I'll be back. You guys... Boom it up. Yeah, now we're gonna now we're now you've made me do the boomins, the metro boomins, if you will. That's fair. Um, so make this a creature with Karn. That cool? Yep. Yeah, okay, is that gonna, cool? I'm gonna activate it. Uh, heads, everything goes boom. That's tails. Um, rats. Darn. I'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna untap it with my voyaging slater. Ah. Yeah. All right. Heads. That's tails. What is what's going on here? Um, what is going on is you're delaying the inevitable. Yeah, I am. With your terrible flipping. Four, six. Uh, I'm gonna. I have six in my pool. I'm gonna use Magus of the Camber Lobber to untap one, two. I guess we'll just do two for now and leave four in my pool. All right. Boom pile. Same thing. That's a heads. All right. So all these are gone. All ten of my clues. You have to sack a clue to get the, t the, the trigger on Tyler's tracker, Justin. Oh, yeah. I guess I just usually always sack them. Yeah. I never just destroy things. I sacrifice them, so. I understand. It's all the same to me. Yeah. Um. Destroyed. I have four floating. We'll spend. Sure, we'll spend four on. Jeremy, I really want you to die to commander damage. I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. I don't that's think I can get there. And, um, yeah, I don't think that's the case. Play more. All right. Uh, I don't think I have enough to do it all. Well, you, all right. you, could, you could have saved that that uh, Shadow Sphere, and then um, that was another creature. Yeah, that's true. That's true. I probably could have. Probably should have. All right. Um, so that's all my mana. Yep, and one cards. So this is four, eight, uh, 11, 14, 17. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. Am I really not going to be able to kill you? That's silly. All right. For some reason, I feel like it's, you know, you close might... enough. All right. Let's go to combat. Okay. These are all coming at you. These guys will hang back. However much power you said it was. So it's 16 from Ashaya, 20, 24, 27, 30, 33, 34, 35, 36, 38, 39, 40. No, I can't kill you. All right. Um, take it. Okay. Take it. So how much is the total? Whatever I just said it was. You, you started, <laughs> you kept counting up and then you said, oh, that oh, not enough I to kill Kyle you. Oh, I thought Kyle caught it. He got it. There you are. You're at seven. All right. All right. I'm at seven. Go ahead. All right. All right, Jeremy. Two mana in my pool. Draw my card for the turn. That's a mutable. 
Um, I don't think this is very good because I still think that you kill me. This is the turn to cast the things that aren't very good. Your last one. In that, I still think it's actually pretty good. Um, it's cast arm again. God, you have two fantastic. mana from your mana drain. Don't forget. I do have two mana from my mana drain, but I Armageddon. can't use Jeez. I can't use that colorless mana for this eerie ultimatum. Does that return everything from your graveyard? Uh, any number of Perna cards with different names. Okay. All right. Let me see your graveyard. What you got? Uh, Thieving Skydiver, Drana, Minan Den, Marchesa, Venser, Nyambi, Edric, Rada. Arcane Signet, Prismatic Omen are all the permanents. Are anything gonna, is anything going to gain haste? Uh, not at the moment, no. All right. Uh, two, three, four. Uh, I'll respond. Okay. Two, three, four. What you doing there, Stephen? I'm going to untap my Castle Garenbrig with four mana floating and activate it for six. Okay. And then I'm going to activate Scavenging Ooze to uh, exile. What do you got there? Ten total permanents coming into play. Uh, yep. All right, you can get, you can keep the Arcane Signet in there, the Prismatic Omen in there, uh, the Edric, and uh, I don't, the, the Thieving Sky Diver can all stay in there. Told you it wasn't going to be very good. Because obviously John is cheating with a Benny deck, as we all know. I knew as soon as he says Benny, I was like, "Well, oh, it's a Benny deck." Oh, okay. So we're all we're all just completely done here. That's that's just sometimes what you die to a glass cannon Karanos deck. Every time. <laughs> all right, you got your two creatures and your that prismatic omen and your arcane signet. All right, one, two. No, you don't have a clue to steal. Three. <laughs> You can't kick it for zero, Justin. Four, five, Hazri. Yep. And and Chris. all right, we knew about that one. That one's been hanging out in there. Yep. Probably could have actually saved me a mana there. You know what? We'll be all right. It's gonna be fine. It's going to be fine in that I'm dead. I'm going to turn all my cards sideways. Well, you, look, you. You, look, you look dead. Well, you know, if I could just get a Shia, I could just Urza's Ruinous Blast, but I can't because uh, no, they're speak. all lands. See, you can't. Yeah. I'm going to pass the turn and then die. All right. All right. Yeah. I think he's dead. Yep. Yeah, I'm just going to. Well, he's dead like a duck, and he's walking around like a duck. You're going to make me do it, Jeremy? Is that what's happening here? I scooped up my cards here. Okay, I don't know what you're cool, talking about. Cool, cool, cool. Right. Well, 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 Steven. No, I, was hoping, I was hoping that one of the, the, the seamen were going to get it out. Well, no, we just died. We did. Oh, I died of your hands. Uh, Fate's hands. They were claws. You, 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 claws. you couldn't have get... I just wanted... All I wanted was that one turn reprieve. It tried... I tried really hard to squeeze John. So many you, times. You and could he, have... He, didn't. he was so slippery, okay? And you I had that... Crab. And had I had that Venser. You had, I had the knife that, and the crab. Yeah, and if there was he, a there. If he went after me, I, I would have had the Venser that he's been fearing since the beginning of the season. Mm, you know how mad I'd have been about that Vincer? I'd have been quite upset if it got Vincer. I'm glad that that didn't happen. You should have farmed a point, Jeremy. I should have. Steven, yeah, you, you really needed Justin to combat John because he, yeah. he had. I had the sweep. I had the sweepers in the spot removal. Yeah, he'd slipped past me one too many times. Steven, I let my guard down one time, and it was that very last you... turn. Randomly let you deciding you're going to do random and then randomly choosing me and being like, Oh, I couldn't do anything to prevent this. It was random is like an elected official saying, Someone should stop all of these terrible things happening. Someone that has control over this should just do something about it. But you're know. just sitting there, you're like, It was I random. To, There's I nothing to, I could do. Beast crab brain, man. I don't know what to do. Just, just pinch. That's just, just pinch. Just squeeze them. That's all I know. You know, what we should... time, when it came time, you were the closest to squeeze. Let me get down what, here. What we shouldn't have to do is squeeze our viewers 
to like, comment, share, subscribe, and binge on YouTube, which is, of course, where you're watching because that's all we got right now. Uh, you can also follow us all on Twitter at RedneckWins, at A Natural Death, at Jeremy Knoll, and at JParnell1, of course, at DAR Kyle West, hashtag scoops, if you want to get your fill of point screens, which is how we're doing them for now. I understand that we've changed some things up and the point screens aren't appearing. In our defense, there was a week that no one submitted any point screens. We just thought that was the end. We just thought that was it forever. True. So I'm not going to support that version of truth. Maybe look at maybe look in the mirror. But you can see these point screens on Twitter every week. Hashtag scoops. Yeah. Hashtag I'm not trying to say that where you're from sucks, but <laughs> where you're from sucks. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Um. But anyway, follow at Dr. Kyle West. Get those point screens, and of course, use hashtag CMDRVS hashtag Commander versus every week. Now, we also have sponsors. We have Carnox chairs, which we have right here. We definitely don't have any other chairs that are from competitors in any of our rooms. Oh, uh, you can't see it. I've covered it up, so that's yeah, true. We, you've covered nothing up because there's nothing to see. You can go to Carnox.com slash SCG to get 10% off of any chair, any chair of your choice. You don't have to get these. You can get any Carnox chair 10% off. Yeah, just make sure you say any Carnox chair. You said any chair before, like. Any chair on Carnox's yeah, website. Yeah, you're Herman Miller there. Okay, that's not happening. You can Call, get you Steven's email, actual chair. <laughs> you email Carnox. Yeah. I would like that. I would like that chair. Yeah, uh, that one. You can also, of course, go to uh, coltlessapparel.shop and use gift code SCG at checkout to save 10% off. I was trying to represent the, uh, what is this? The un, unearthly Ola. So yeah, okay, they un also unearthly any obligations. Any teacher. When I was playing clerics, but Stephen, Stephen hates clerics, so. Yeah, I squeezed him. Yeah, so he made sure that wasn't able to happen. You pinched. He pinched, pinched him too hard. That was a real they hard pinch. They're uh, they're coming out with shirts fast, fast and loose on the shirts. So if you want to look at the entire selection, colossapparel.shop, gift code SCG at checkout, give you ten percent off. Now, we also want to remind you, there's a million products coming out in Magic the Gathering, as you know, because uh, it's the day of the week. So that means three weeks from now, a new product's going to come out. I don't know which one. And in fact, it actually doesn't matter when you watch this episode. That will always be true. So if you want to save on getting Magic cards, you can sign up for SEG Premium. Not only does it give you access to a bunch of articles, including articles from Sheldon, from Benny, from other people that don't write about Commander. They write about other stuff. Because well, they're well-rounded like Magic players. Patrick Sullivan. You can see some Patrick Sullivan content, see? Yeah, which is great. In addition to that, you also get 15% uh, off supplies. Whatever your favorite Magic card sleeves, deck boxes are, 15% off of those. 10% off of any singles, including pre-order pre singles. So if there's any set coming out, like Commander Legends, and you want to get a little pre-order action, 10% off. And if you want sealed product, you get 5% off with SCG Premium. So that is the show for this week. I also want to plug Stephen and I's podcast. It's called Think Twice MTG. You can search Think Twice MTG on any audio platform, as well as my stream, which is twitch.tv slash Parnell every Monday and Saturday evening. And water break. Hydrate. Why aren't That's the rest right. of you hydrating? Jeez. Hydrate bot. That was the that was the opportunity for someone else to say anything. Uh, ah, no. oh, okay. Well, I also stream Monday and Saturday nights, most Monday and Saturday nights, uh, twitch.tv slash Jeremy Knoll, uh, Paper Commander with uh, my good friend uh, Olivia Gobert-Hicks, and also stream on her channel on occasion as well. Excellent. Uh, and John has a chair that he's sitting in. Great. Feels fantastic. Great. Excellent. That is it. That is the show for this week. We will be back next week. Uh, not exactly with the same theme, but we're yeah, we're gonna yeah, yeah, we're, gonna, we're, we're, we're gonna hang we're gonna be hanging around where we are now. That's that's your little hint. It's so, time, right? I'm I'm out of here. Yeah. Uh, for Stephen Green, he can get out first. For Jeremy Noel, for John Suarez, for Director Kyle West, 
I'm Justin Parnell. We'll see you folks next week.